Hi guys. I have some things I want to share with you. And this was like a game changer for me because I, it, it took me 10 years to figure this thing out. And when I joined Scentsy guys, I was new to Scentsy, had never heard of it. My sponsor was new to Scentsy. So we were really just trying to figure this thing out. We didn't have what we have now. We weren't even able to work our business from our phone. We had to work it from the computer at home because we had to download a program. So things were so different when I joined Scentsy. Uh, didn't have a lot of leadership around because all of us joined right around the same time. We didn't have Facebook groups. We didn't have any of that stuff. So I, if other than the workstation training, I had to go to YouTube to figure other things out because that's the way it was back then. So I'm going to throw some numbers at you guys because I see a lot of times consultants, when they run into a, a brick wall, they just stop right there. And some of them not just stop right there, they quit or they, it's, they get so frustrated because they're thinking that they're a failure because of the fact that things don't seem to work for them at the moment. And you know what, guys, when you think about this, the way Sensi has this set up, the shooting star, for example, most consultants, a lot of consultants hit that because when they join Sensi, they're super excited and they the clock is ticking as soon as they join. They're running, running, running full force to hit that shooting star. Some of them do it the first day. Some of them do it in a few days. I had a girl yesterday join and, well, actually she joined Friday and she did it in five days. So then we have the sensational start level one, two, and three. And when they see those, the potential to get all the, the extra stuff, they gun it and they run for it because they're excited. They want to tell the world about what they're doing. But somehow along the way, we lose that because it's like the circle that we're, we're sharing this with, that circle becomes small and smaller and smaller. And because we're in our comfort zone, we don't want to branch outside that circle. So then we start getting discouraged and numbers start falling. Numbers start dropping because we're not willing to step out there. So I'm going to tell you guys some of the things that I did. Now, when I joined Sensi guys, I, I had one whole party when I started. It wasn't one that I had. My friend hosted the party for me. It was an amazing party because I got two new team members from the party and my sales were like $1,100 from that party. So guys, partying is, is where it is. But because I didn't get that at the beginning, I start working events. So partying is not what I want to do. I really didn't have time because of the fact that I was working so many events. And like, I just, I'm still thrilled about events. I love events because I, I, I can just go in there and set up and I know people are going to come. But the one thing that I wasn't getting from my events is that I wasn't booking parties at my events because I didn't have time. And parties are golden. And I, I still didn't understand that. It took me 10 years to figure out that party parties are golden. And you don't have to work as hard physically for parties. Physically, if you're working a lot of events like I did, you get tired over time. Because physically is, is involved when you're doing a lot of them like I did. I was working two to four, sometimes five large events in a month. It can, it can, you, can get, you can experience burnout with that. Although my sales were strong, people were joining my team like crazy. But what happens, that's not so much duplicatable because everybody can't work those big events. Um, so I'm going to go over some things with you guys because after, after you know, last year, all of, everything shut down. So I could not work my business the way I was accustomed to working my business. And it's something about us. We're conditioned to do something for so long. It's hard to break that. It's hard to get out of that and do something different. And you know what? And sometimes it's scary. It's scary sometimes to try something new because we know what we know, what we know, but to break outside of what we know is scary on the other side. But that's when the magic takes place. The magic takes place on the other side, not within that circle that we know. So I'm going to run some numbers by you guys. And it's like it took me forever to get this, guys. So if it took me 10 years to get this, guys, 
And a lot of you are new. And if you're running into brick walls, it's because of the fact that you're not willing to step outside that circle. And that's what a magic takes place. Yes, it takes place outside of that circle. It takes place when you go out there and find another way. There are too many ways. Guys, I've been doing this almost 12 years and I still have not done everything. There's no such thing as doing everything because you haven't. Okay, in August, and I'm focusing on August because we're in August right now. So I went back to 2019. 2019, guys, my PRV was 6,412, August of 2019. And it was because I was working events. That was pretty. That was a pretty large amount for PRB. I was working events. So as people buy things, I replace those items. Now, TWV stands for Team Wholesale Volume. So I have a downline. So my Team Wholesale Volume at that time was 67,234. Now we have Group Wholesale Volume, it's GWV. So my group wholesale volume was 67,234. Granted guys, my team wholesale volume and my group wholesale volume, they matched. They were the same number. I'm gonna tell you guys why they were the same number. It's because at the time I didn't have any directors pay that title. Get it guys. I had zero directors pay that title in 2019 in August. Now, I'm a superstar director, okay? And I get to keep my title, but I did not get paid that title because I had no active directors at that time. In order for me to get paid at superstar director title, I had to have four paid at title directors. I had none because my team and my group wholesale volume matched, okay? My team number, I had 494. I had 494 in my group, in my team, on my team, and in my group was uh, 494. Those numbers matched again, just like the the, the uh, group wholesale and team wholesale. My team and my group numbers matched 494 because I had no no directors at the time paid a title. I and I I actively had 58 frontline active at the time. I had 13 new consultants to join my team in August of 2019, okay? I was paid at director's title at that time. Even though I'm a superstar director, I was paid at director's title, all right? Okay, stay with me, guys. I'm going to post these numbers so you guys can see it once I finish. Okay, and in 2020, in August, my PRB was 3,018. See there, my PRV dropped like half because I didn't have any events in 2020. All my events canceled. Okay, my team wholesale volume, it dropped a little bit. I had 61,598 team wholesale volume. My group wholesale volume went up. I had 175,091 group wholesale volume, and I'm gonna tell you guys why, okay? Because I had four active directors in August of last year, four. So I got paid at title last August. My team size was 508. My group, uh, my group number was 964 but my team was 508. And those numbers don't match this time because once my directors got paid that title, my frontline directors got paid that title, they had their team. So those numbers don't match anymore. My active frontline consultants were 62 last year. I had seven new team numbers, seven, okay? So in 2020, I learned how to work my business virtually. I went to YouTube and watched a lot of videos to see how to work my business virtually. Since I, you know, I, I, for 10 years, guys, I've been working events. So I didn't know anything about how to work parties. I didn't even know how to book a party. I didn't know how to do a virtual party. I didn't even know how to do an at-home party. 
I didn't know how to do basket parties. I wasn't doing those things, guys. But 2020 made me go figure it out. 2020 made me figure it out. Because let me tell you guys, I had two options in 2020. I could sit there, kick and scream, and complain about everything shutting down and go to zero. Or I could sit there and roll my sleeves up and figure out a way to make this work. And that's what I did. I chose the other one. I chose to roll my sleeves up and go figure out a plan. That's what I did. I chose that one. I didn't want the other one. I didn't want to sit there and kick and scream and complain about what wasn't happening. I wasn't going to do that. I knew that was a way. I said, let me find that way. Let me go figure this thing out. Because there were too many consultants already doing this before COVID. Too many consultants out there have been working their business online. I wasn't. So it was scary to me to do it that way because I hadn't done it before. Anything, any troubles that you guys face, if you're facing troubles, is because you have not figured it out yet. You're not trying to go figure it out. You, you, that's, why, that's why you're stuck right there. But you have options, okay? You don't have to be stuck right there. Okay, let me tell you where I am now for 2021. Here's another challenge, guys. This is another challenging year. One year after another, face, you're facing with challenges. Last year, everything was shut down. So everybody's in the house. Everybody's on social media. Everybody's trying to figure this thing out. So this year, people are moving around. People are moving around right now, guys. So we're faced with new challenges. So those things that fell in our lap last year are not falling in our laps this year. We got to go out there and figure things out again. Here I am trying to figure this thing out again. All the, my events, guys, I have maybe two or three events that open up for me this year. That's it. That's it. So the things that I've been doing virtually like last year, they're not all working like they did last year. They're not. So that means I got to figure out a new way again. So guys, you got to always be in a situation where you got to go figure this thing out. You got to always be open-minded to figure it out. There's a way out of this situation, guys. But are you willing to go find it? There, there's so much out there, guys, on YouTube. And not only that, let me, let me, let me give Team Traveling Sense a hand over here. Because you guys are awesome over here. All this post your page stuff, guys. There's a lot of work that go into the post your page post that, that's posted over here every day. And it hurts my heart when I hear people say, well, I don't know what to do. And the things are given to us. Over here, they're given to us. Although this stuff is given to us, we still have to go out there and figure some things out ourselves. But it's one thing when you're so accustomed to things handed to you. And when things aren't handed to you, then you're trying, then you're struggling. No, guys, you got to go out there and find a way. You got to go make a way. One thing I know, guys, things will always get in our way all the time. We're faced with challenges most times. I never thought that my mama would be in a situation where she won't eat and be rushed to the hospital. And everything I've done so far, I got to stop. It came to a screeching halt. I had to stop and spend a whole week in the hospital with her. Things happen, guys, that's out of our control. But when those things happen out of our control, what do you do? Do you just sit there and cry about it and say, oh my gosh, this is happening to me. It shouldn't happen to me. No, you go do something about that. You change the way you handle that. I started going live with mama. People love mama. People start praying for mama. People started buying from me because they saw that. I even met a person at the hospital that joined my team because of mama being sick. Guys, I mean, there's so much that we can do. Okay, let me go back to my numbers for this year. Currently, my PRV is $5,033, guys. My PRV right now, guys, is $5,033. Not because of events. No. It's because I get up every morning with a plan. I get up every morning trying to see who I can give a birthday shout out to. I get up every morning trying to see who I can go out there and thank for making an order for me and following up with them to see who wants a shopping link. 
or go out there and see what referrals I can get every day. Even though I'm posting and training, I still got my customers I got to work with. All things that's happening with me right now is done virtually because I'm not, I don't have an event this month, but yet I'm going to figure out some kind of way to make this happen. Although things will change because people are different. People are moving about the cabin right about now. They are just like they are, or the pilot would say, uh, it's free to move about the cabin right now when you're on an airplane. So people are moving around. So people mindsets are different than they were last year. So you got to change with the wind. Now the team wholesale volume is right now is 43,188. We got three days left. That's going to change. I know. So but right now it's at 43,188. The group wholesale volume right now is 131,295. We got three days left. I can see that changing. The team size, the team size that I have is 731. Our group size is $1,735. No, that's not dollars. <laughs> I'm so excited. Our team size is $1,735. <laughs> I got carried away on that one. <laughs> so my active front line is 42. But my new team members that I personally have recruited this month is 13, guys. 13. 13. I'm doing it all online. Everything that you see here, guys, now, our group numbers are amazing. Our group size is amazing. But now, we still got three days left. So, currently, I am already paid that title for Superstar Director title already. Now, granted, back in 2019, when I was working real hard, physically working all those events, but yet I was not getting paid that title. That's because I was not partying. And I didn't know how to teach my team members how to party. But I could teach you guys how to party. I could tell you how to party now. I couldn't tell you guys how to do that before. I could tell you to offer people a shopping link. Whenever somebody buys something from you, you offer them a shopping link. That's another way of partying. You can offer somebody a join link. That's another way of partying. You can offer somebody a birthday link. That's another way of partying. You can offer somebody a fundraiser link. That's another way of partying. So sometimes people don't want to hear the word party. Change your, ch change your terminology. Change up what you're saying. Some of these people who are out there asking for people to help raise money for a uh, charitable cause tied to their birthday, reach out to them. Create an event for them. That's a, just another way of partying, guys. You can do like the spoiler senior campaign that I do. Something similar to that. That's another way of partying. It's all about how you, 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 what you think about this stuff, guys. It's not hard at all. It's about your mindset. It's not hard at all. Those people, those of you with this high PRB, don't forget to always keep an open party and always bless somebody with the opportunity to start since you at no cost. Don't close a party without a team member, guys. These are things that I didn't think a whole lot about prior to 2019. It took me 10 years to figure this out, guys. 10 years. It took me 10. So you guys don't have that long to figure it out because you're hearing it from us. And we're here to help you. And you can do it, guys. You, got, you know, I mean, you know a whole lot of what uh, what needs to happen before I even did. I'm, I'm late trying to figure this thing out. But it's never too late. It's never too late to go and change this thing around, guys. It's never too late. Go do it. Keep your eye on the prize. Don't worry about what's going on to the right, to the left. Keep your eye on the prize. Don't worry about who's passing you. Don't worry about who's promoted before you and they started after you. Don't worry about that. Keep your eye on the prize. You get there and you say, I'm next. That's what I did, guys. When I saw so many people promoting all over me and around me, I kept saying, I'm next. I figured out at some point, I'm going to figure this thing out. And I eventually did. Guys, that's going to be your plan. Since last year, I have not missed getting paid at title. 
And it took me forever to get paid that title after I promoted to the highest title with Cincy. I promoted to Superstar Director in 2017, guys, in November. Okay? It took me three years to get back to pay that title. It took me three years to get there. But that's okay. I got there. So it doesn't matter how long it takes you to get there, guys. You keep your eye on the prize. You keep going. You do not get discouraged by no means. You keep going. It's eventually going to happen. But you got to know it in here. You got to know it here. Don't say I'm trying. Don't say that. Don't say I'm trying. No, do it. That's the only way you're going to do it. You got to say, I'm going to do it. Because what happens when you say, I'm trying, it leaves room for error. I never, when I tried my best, or when I claimed, I'm sorry. <laughs> when I claimed that I was going to promote to the highest title with Sensi Guys, I claimed it. I said, I'm doing it. I didn't say I'm trying. I said, I'm going to do that. I'm doing that. Whatever it takes, I'm going to do it. It took, I claimed it in December of 2016, guys. And I did it in November of, it was October. I got the dates mixed up. Anyway, it was, in two, it was late 2017 when I did it. It could have been, it was like late October uh, when I promoted to Superstar Director. But I claimed it the year before. So whatever you want to do in this business, guys, I want you to write it down. I want you to claim that. And I want you to stay focused. I want you to do whatever is necessary to get to that point. Okay, guys, I love you. I love you guys so much, but I want you to know that you can do whatever you set your mind to do. Love you. Bye.